Good day everyone. This is Rosa for Splat Communications and Simplified Strategic Solutions. Manila Times released a news article a few days ago regarding presidential candidate Mayor Isco Moreno as being a survey top-notcher in Region 1 or Ilocos Region. This region is one-third of the so-called Solid North, a known bailiwick of the Marcos family for decades. Today we shall compare the data published in the aforementioned newspaper against our own Cayley survey summary data. It would be really interesting to find out their similarities or differences. Let's go! Let us now watch the brief introductory video. We read the requests of our subscribers and viewers for us to make a comparison about the results. So, we are more than happy to oblige. According to the news article, the survey was conducted by the group named Citizens Movement Against Crime, Corruption, Illegal Drugs and Gambling Incorporated. We shall subsequently refer to this as CMACCIDG. The details of the survey is noted on the Manila Times article. The survey had a total of 22,500 respondents spread over Region 1 or Ilocos Region. The sampling methodology used was face-to-face -face survey with survey forms. The survey was conducted from October 20th to November 20th of the current year. There were four target areas in the said survey. Ilocos Sur, Ilocos Norte, La Onion, and Pangasinan. Here is the summary of their survey. Senator Bongo is still included in the list of choices as he has not yet withdrawn his candidacy at the time the survey was conducted. We tabulated the results and computed for the percentages as the newspaper article only described the results according to the numerical count. Here is the screenshot of the tally we prepared. According to the CMACCIDG survey, Senator Manny had the least percentage among all the presidentials with 5.36%. He is followed by Senator Ping Laxon with 8.87%. Senator Bongo is next with a total of 9.85% in the four areas mentioned. VP Lenny Roberto had the third highest percentage at 12.44%. Former Senator Bongbong Marcos is second overall with 19% and Mayor Isco Moreno had 42.12%. Here is the table once again. If anyone wishes, they can validate this data from the news article itself. Kindly let us know if we missed anything. Let us now look at the Cayley survey summary for Region 1. The region has 6,553 respondents. Undecided is 5.14%. In ascending order and not necessarily according to how each was placed on the screen. Senator Bongo has 0.12%, Senator Ping is next with 0.95%. Senator Manny is next with 1.83%. The third presidential with the highest percentage for this period in Region 1 is VP Lenny with 4.55%. Mayor Isco is second with 4.97%. 
Former Senator Bongbong Marcos is on top with 82.44%. Now comes the most exciting and interesting part. The comparison of the data between the two. Are you ready? Let's do this. We shall read the data per candidate. All of these figures are percentages. The first one we will mention is the data of CMACCIDG. These are the numbers that are horizontally arranged. You can see these on the top level of the table. Immediately after that, we shall mention the Splat Communications Kaley Survey Summary data. The figures are at the middle layer horizontally. Afterwards, we shall look at their similarities or differences. You will see these at the bottom of the table, enclosed in a red rectangle. If everything is clear, let us proceed. Let us start this off with the data of Senator Bongo. In the CMACCIDG survey, he has 9.85% while in Splat Communications or SC, he has 0.12%. There is a difference of 9.73 percentage points between the two data. Next are the numbers of Senator Ping Laksen. He has 8.87% in the CMACCIDG, while in SC Kaley Survey Summary, he has 0.95%. There is a difference of 7.92 percentages points. Let us now look at the percentages of Senator Manny. In the CMACCIDG, he has 5.36% overall for Region 1. In the Splat KSS, Kaley Survey Summary, he has 1.83% or a difference of 3.53%. For VP Lenny Roberto, she has 12.44% in the CMACCIDG. Her Splat percentage for Region 1 is 4.55%. There is a difference of 7.89% between the two studies. The top notcher in four provinces of Region 1 according to CMACCIDG is Mayor Isco Moreno. He has an overall percentage of 42.14%. In Splat Com KSS. He has 4.97%. There is a huge difference between these two figures. 37.17 percentage points. Last but not the least, let us now look at the data for BBM. He only has 19% in the CMACCIDG while in Splatcom KSS, he has 82.44%. The 63.44 percentage point difference is outrageously significant in any way, manner, shape, or form. Let us now focus our attention to the bottom level of the table. Did you notice that all percentages from every candidate in the CMACCIDG Region 1 survey are all higher than those of Splatcom KSS? Except for one candidate, BBM. He is the only presidential candidate with a low or decreased total percentage among the rest with respect to the CMACCIDG data. As you can see, we have encircled the differences for emphasis and guide. Time for another simple math pop quiz. What is the total of all those encircled percentages in the bottom layer of the chart? Please don't include BBM. If you have finished adding it up, why and how is that number you came up with significant? Please explain or jot down your answers in the comment portion. Again, we at Splat Communications and at Simplified Strategic Solutions thank all of you from the bottom of our hearts for all your support. We have taken note of all your comments and suggestions and shall implement them as soon as we can. Please hit the like button if you like this video, kindly subscribe if you haven't yet and share the video so that others may learn too with us. This ends this statistical data comparison video. For Splat Communications and Simplified Strategic Solutions, this is Rosa, till next time. Bye. Stay safe.